trunk, bitch, there you go. Well, hello. Our travel guides are taking a walk through the 500-year-old streets of Jodhpur's Blue City. This is like your place is stuck. Cattle everywhere. It's the Blue City, we have never seen anything like it. There's cattle on the streets, there's animals everywhere. <laughs> I just stood in shit. <laughs> you won't get any steak from these sacred cows, but there's plenty of moo juice. We've seen the milkman arrive. He's got his big tank of milk, whistles out old love. That's probably coming straight from the cow, straight to them. Yeah, it will be. Oh. Gives her a few scoops of milk. It was like from back 200 years ago. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Look how beautiful all the blue is. <laughs> the friends have left their Mark Haraja back at the hotel. Bit of the IBS happening. Well, he always says he's got it. He's finally got a bit of deli belly. It's a brave man that can fart in India, and I wasn't prepared to take that risk. <laughs> so I decided to stay back in bed. Beautiful. Why is it all blue? Because Lord Siva and Lord Vishnu's colour is a blue. Oh, this place is crazy. The boys are learning about Hindu gods and local life from a guide. Namaste, hello. Namaste. Namaste. Do you live here? Is this your house? We stumble upon this man and he just sees us walking and he's like, you know, do you want to come in? Oh, shukriya. Shukriya. The hospitality is so nice here. He's so humble, like, they give us water. He just shows us how they live. This is insane. No one ever just invites you into their house. I know, if someone invited you in Melbourne, you'd run. They live a very simple life, but they're really happy. Thank <laughs> you.